Dune University is uh, strongly focused on three areas languages, communication and new media, and tourism and the art. Over the past 20 years, Ulm has invested a lot in research and education on tourism and hospitality. We were the first university in Italy to offer a Bachelor in Tourism. We launched the first university master's degree in hospitality and tourism entirely in English, and also the first master's degree with an international hospitality school in 2016. This year, Yul made it into the QS World University Rankings for Hospitality and Leisure Management. Yul has a unique position in international education on tourism and hospitality, based on first a multidisciplinary approach that combines management, geography, anthropology and art and culture, all essential to understanding tourism, but also a vision of tourism as a key driver for the development of other sectors food and wine, fashion, design, the creative industries, and especially made in Italy. And these qualities are so highly appreciated by leading companies and institutions that they have become Yulm's partner in several research and educational projects. And students, the participation of students in these same projects adds real world value to their study program. Three features make the Master in Hospitality and Tourism Management an exciting place to specialize in tourism management. First, the close collaboration with companies in the sector. Second, the international experience for our students. And third, an interactive learning approach. Uh, let's take a closer look at these features. The collaboration with companies is crucial to identifying their needs and the key area of specialization for students. Tourism and hospitality are both evolving rapidly and Yulm works with major companies in the sector to design programs in line with their business expectations and to train sought-after professionals difficult to find in the job market. The international experience is essential to train skilled professionals in the new scenario. The program is developed over two years. The first year takes place at Yulm University in Milan where um, we have an international faculty and students with different national backgrounds. By the end of this year, each student chooses their specialization for the second year. Here, one option is the dual degree in uh, hospitality and tourism management at the University of Central Florida in Orlando, where students uh, earn an Italian degree, laurea magistrale, from Ulm, and an American degree, the Master of Science, from University of Central Florida as well uh, the possibility of staying in the US after the graduation for one year of work in the tourism sector. The other path takes place at Ulm in Milano with the two, specialization, two possible specializations, digital technologies and data for tourism and creative industry and sustainable destinations management and communication. In the first specialization path, students will gain skills in exploiting the potential of new digital technologies, big data and artificial intelligence for the innovation of the customer experience and to enhance performance. Uh, in the second uh, specialization on sustainable destinations, uh, students learn how to design and implement effective destination development strategies. But in both specializations, students develop their experience with the period abroad. That can be for study at top partner university, for internship, or for research towards a master's thesis. At this point, let me leave the floor to professors and students to give you more details about the HCM experience. And I hope to welcome you at the Ulm in the next academic year. What we have been observing over the last few years is that, in fact, after finishing this course, students can decide to apply for internships, global internship, international internships in this industry, or they can really also take whatever they have learned and put it inside other industries like the hospitality industry. This really means that if you have been through five years of your studies and you decide to dig deeper into uh, the leisure industry through this course, I'm sure you can be a professional in several different jobs and in several different positions, not only in the leisure industry, but generally speaking in the tourism industry. 
For the second year, I chose the path in uh, digital technologies and data for tourism and creative industry because uh, I'm very passionate of uh, digital technologies, uh, IT, and I think that data nowadays are uh, fundamental for uh, every strategy and every real focus on the market uh, and that could be very useful to know something more and something practical, uh, tailor-made on, on the tourism market. The main themes of, of the course are related to sustainable development and sustainability in tourist development context. We focus on, on the idea of sustainability and sustainable tourism, followed by discussions and examples on tourism impacts. The course continues by focusing on the limits to growth and how to govern and manage tourism in various scales and locations in both Global South and Global North. Furthermore, we'll discuss the idea of sustainable development goals and how tourists could contribute to different sustainable development goals by 2030. Furthermore, we'll uh, discuss the key challenges, including the relationship between global tourism and, and climate change. Finally, we conclude by thinking the future of tourism and how to govern the growth and development of tourism in a way that it would serve the sustainable development needs. But why did I particularly choose the university? I like the vibe. Foremost before everything, I like the vibe, I like the staff, I must admit that. They were immense help when I was in the application process. And I saw myself in tourism anyway, so it was the best option possible, of course. When it comes to the courses that I've enjoyed over the, these two very important for my life years, I would primarily put the most important ones the, where we studied marketing strategies and the one with aspect to sustainable development. We all know it's a huge deal today, the sustainable development thing, and the strategies regarding that are important, especially for our studies. So territorial marketing and hospitality marketing are one within the other. So within, uh, as far as territorial, you are talking about a destination or place, country, area. Hospitality marketing is what you do within that area, so restaurants, hotels, the services provided. And so tools at the bottom of it all are the same. You still have to use all those topics such as I just mentioned before in order to market either hospitality or territorial marketing to the consumer. I decided to study in the United States because it was always a dream of mine and because the Rosen College is the first ranking hospitality school in the United States. So going up from there, I hoped I would get a good job and a good education. One of the best courses that I've done in the United States at Rosen College was the capstone course, a strategic issues in the hospitality and tourism industry. And it was definitely a very challenging course. We had two projects and a personal paper to write, but we also had many field trips and company visits and we had also guest speakers coming in to tell us about their experience in the industry. So with this focus on competencies, we help students to get really ready for the labor market. At the same time, focusing on a specific kind of competencies, namely the social skills, we want them to be ready to manage relations inside the organization. So we think that giving, providing our students with this set of social skills is one of the key differences in the training that we offer them.